Since the process to root and install TWRP on the OnePlus 3T is different than the original OnePlus 3, I decided to do different videos and articles for this device. Now yesterday I showed you how to install TWRP. So if you're unfamiliar with how to do that or just haven't done that on your device yet, be sure to look at that tutorial either on my website or on the YouTube channel. And that will walk you through the entire process to get TWRP installed on your OnePlus 3T. Now in that video I also tell you that in order to boot back into Android after you have installed TWRP you'll either have to do one of two things. You'll either have to root your device with SuperSU or you will have to flash a DM Verity disabler because of how the software is set up on the OnePlus 3T. So if you followed that guide which I showed you I rooted the device then you're already rooted and you're good to go but if you use the disabler or you flashed a custom kernel that disabled that security measure then you likely don't have root access so today I'm going to show you how to root the OnePlus 3T once you have TWRP installed to start we just need to boot into our TWRP custom recovery so we're going to boot into recovery mode and again if you're unfamiliar with how to do this how to boot into recovery mode how to unlock your bootloader or install TWRP check the description below this video as I'll have a link to the full tutorial which will be referencing my previous tutorials that all walk you through the entire process step by step Now naturally you're going to need to download SuperSU ahead of time, which again that download link will be linked in the full tutorial on my website. And if you forget to download it before you boot into TWRP, you can just connect the OnePlus 3T to your computer and then you can move or copy that SuperSU zip file over to your phone. So once you have booted into the TWRP main menu, you just need to tap on the install button, tap on the SuperSU zip file. Now this may bring you up to this directory, the root directory. So if that's the case, you just need to navigate to where you have downloaded or moved that SuperSU file too. For me that is the download folder. For you it might be different. So you just want to tap on the SuperSU zip file. As you can see right here I'm using the 2.79 version of SuperSU on the OnePlus 3T with Oxygen OS 4.0 Nougat. I had previously tried to root this with the beta SR version of SuperSU. The version I tried did not work properly. There was a, I believe there was an, uh, some kind of error. SU Linux, I'm not sure. There was some kind of error. So using the actual stable version of 2.79 works flawlessly. So just tap on that swipe the white arrows to the right to begin the installation
As you can see, the process only takes a minute or two. You just want to wait until the whole thing is done. Make sure you don't get any errors, which you shouldn't. The unable to mount storage error at the very, very beginning is okay, but for the process of installing SuperSU, everything should be good. And you should take a look at the important notice right here, telling us that our first reboot will be longer than normal. For the OnePlus 3T, it will also reboot a second time. And I'll show you that process right now. So once that's done, unless you need to do anything else in the TWRP menu, just go ahead and tap on the Reboot System button. It's going to go through the normal boot animation sequence. We're going to be asked to put in our pin pattern or password. Assuming you have one set up. And then the phone's going to reboot. This is normal for the first boot after you have rooted the device. You can see we're going to go through the same process. It's going to ask us for the pin pattern or password again. Except this time it's not going to reboot after we put it in. That part is just the process of rooting the phone completely. And it's been pretty common with SuperSU for the last year or so. So they just want they just tell you that notice just to make sure that you don't get paranoid by the phone rebooting like that and that is how to install super su and gain root access to the oneplus 3t